John Bernthal. I'm Georgia Wiggum, and I'm here to answer some Marvel fan questions. This question is for John. What is the most fun part about playing Frank Castle? I try to avoid avoid fun as, as much as possible. I do enjoy the, the stunts. It's a team we've been working together for three years now, and it becomes stunt time. It becomes uh, time to do the fights. It's uh, it's fun. It's fun in a different way, and it's, uh, it's much more of an athletic experience. For Georgia, what was your reaction when you were cast? And how does it feel like to be a part of, the, of a, a Marvel franchise? Would you and Frank Castle get along in real life? One, when I was cast, I was overwhelmed and overjoyed it was like I, I don't know it was a it was a really surreal feeling especially because Amy's based loosely on the actual character from the comic books it's um overwhelming and I never really imagined I'd be a part of the franchise would you and Frank Castle get along in real life weirdly I would say yeah what is one thing you admire about your character and what is one thing you wish you could change about him or her I admire his uh his code, I, I admire uh, that he's a soldier, uh, that, that he's a vet. Um, I admire how, how much he, uh, I know you asked for one thing, but I'm giving you a couple, uh, Liz. You know, I admire how much his family meant to him. I wish he could just take his foot off the gas uh, every, every now and then. And I think that's sort of what we get into a little bit this season. Um, he takes his foot off for one second and it, and it slaps him in the face pretty hard. But I hope that uh, somewhere down the road, Frank Castle can, um, can, can find a little bit of peace. I admire Amy's courage, her uh, wittiness, I guess you could say. Um, but I think that, you know, right off the bat, it kind of goes hand in hand with the thing I would change is that she's pretty, in the beginning, you know, she's pretty naive and she doesn't really see or realize how much trouble she is actually in. Her being naive, it, she also is extremely courageous and chooses not to. Um, you know, cower and back and back down, you know. Both, describe the father-daughter dynamic between Amy and Frank and how you each approach that aspect of the show in this season. There's a giant hole in, 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 in Frank's heart and, and he carries his, his daughter and the rest of his family with him, uh, you know, wherever he goes and whatever he does. And um, there's no question that he uh, sees a lot of, of, of his daughter and Amy. Behind the scenes too, we just, our connection, we got super close and we were able to just kind of immediately be ourselves around each other. But, you know, like he said, he knows my dad. So stepping onto that set, he was kind of like automatically a little bit like, you know, protective and like, you know, so, so there was that, um, you know, off the bat. But throughout the season, we just got closer and closer. And